Howdy there, Richard Kinslow here with FeedBandit.com. Uh, today I'm going to be talking to you about the uses of this bucket. That's right. So, what we have here is a already used cattle lick bucket. So on your hunting leases, your ranches and whatnot, you've probably got these things littered out there. Uh, typically landowners and ranchers want to get rid of these buckets uh, just because they are, um, they're empty. So I just want to talk about some of the uses we use them for uh, here, on, uh, here on our place. So first and foremost, as you can see, this bucket is actually made of a really hard, thick plastic, okay? So it makes it ideal for holding water. So right now in the early August, uh, here in Texas, we are in the drought. So I'm actually gonna be taking this particular bucket out to one of our feeder setups, and I'm gonna fill it with water. Uh, I'm gonna try to put it in the shade, obviously, to help with uh, evaporation. So um, as a water trough, it certainly works. Uh, we also use these buckets to transport cottonseed. Uh, so we feed uh, cottonseed really from January to about August here on the ranch. So um, instead of just scooping the cottonseed and putting it in the back of the pickup, on one of our uh, uh, UTVs, we will actually fill these buckets up with cottonseed and then dump it directly into the cottonseed feeders. Uh, makes it a lot easier, it's not as messy, and then of course, as you can see, you can stack the buckets when you're done so they're out of the way. A couple of the other uses we use them for, sometimes we use them for inner buckets. When we're cleaning our deer, our hogs, our turkeys and whatnot, uh, they're good for that. We also use them for storage, you know, probably around your camp, You've always had the need to store you know, little pieces of wood or maybe your hunting gear, something of that nature. Uh, these buckets make a great uh, method for doing that. So uh, just a couple of little tips that I, I thought I'd pass on. So uh, thank you so much for watching and remember support your local feed store.